Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you how to reset a cable box. This is an easy way to fix a cable box that is not working properly. If you have a cable box, whether it's a wireless cable box just like this, or a wired one with a coaxial cable going to the cable box, you can reset it and that usually will solve the problem of it not working. Because from time to time, it doesn't get a signal, you know, sometimes cable cable boxes don't get a signal and things aren't working properly with them and one of the best things that you can do is just do a little quick little reset. So I'll show you how to do it. First of all you want to locate the cable box and there are likely going to be at least two cords going into the cable box. You're going to have a power cord, you're also going to have a video cord, in this case it's an HDMI cord that goes to the TV and then there might be a third cord which is a coaxial cable which is a circular sort of cable connector that you twist in place. Um, in this case this is a wireless box but if yours is a wired box you're going to have that cable connector as well. Okay. Um, so what you want to do is you don't need to worry about any of the other wires other than the power wire. So you're going to locate your power wire and in this case it's this one right over here on the far left. Okay. So I'm going to place the camera down and let's angle it downwards so you can see exactly what I'm doing. Okay. So if you want to reset your cable box and just sort of hope that it works properly because it usually fixes the problem. All that you need to do is find that power cord like I showed you, pull it out. You want to hold it out for about 30 seconds give or take. And what this does, and as I hold it out for 30 seconds I'll explain, what this does is it kind of allows any errors that have occurred within the cable box and the setup of the cable box to sort of reset themselves. So basically it allows the cable box to reset and start fresh to a certain degree um, so that when you plug it back in it will, anything that that was problematic software wise will have sort of corrected itself most of the time. This doesn't work all the time, but it does work to be honest with you most of the time. In my experience with the various cable boxes that I've used, um, every time I've had a problem, I just unplug it for 30 seconds, plug it back in and it's good. Um, it, it allows it to power cycle basically where now when I plug it back in, it's starting fresh to a certain degree. So anything that was in its memory uh, with regards to any problems that might have been uh, occurred in its memory, um, they will hopefully solve themselves. At this point, I can just let it boot up and hopefully the problem will have been solved. That's it. If you want to fix a cable box that is not working properly, the best thing that you can do is reset it and that's how, you, how to do it. You just unplug it for about 30 seconds. Maybe you can even leave it for a minute, but after about 30 seconds, it should power cycle, which means kind of like reset itself and start fresh again to a, not completely fresh. You're not completely starting fresh, but you're starting fresh as in like, it's almost like when you restart a computer to a certain degree. Um, yeah, so that's basically, it's how you do it. If you like this video, Video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.